Aria here, and welcome to the 31st My Little Pony Monday. All right, to start things off, I would like to wish you all a very happy holiday season. I hope you're enjoying any holiday you may or may not be celebrating, whether it's Hanukkah, Christmas, or Hearth Swarming Eve. <laughs> Anywho, I hope you're all having a wonderful time celebrating or getting ready for, you know, celebrating later on. But I have had a wonderful year. 2013 has been awesome. And I hope you all enjoyed it as well. So I would like to show you a lot of cool stuff this week. I just got back from a really awesome Christmas party with a bunch of my friends and it was wonderful. I mean, we had, you know, a white elephant giveaway, which is fun, but my favorite part was just kind of all the little surprise gifts that I really wasn't expecting from some of my awesome friends and it was a blast. And what was kind of hilarious is that the majority, if not all of my gifts that were bought specifically for me, were pony related. <laughs> my friends know me so well. <laughs> I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Anywho, so to start things off, I actually got two of the awesome little blind box figurines from Funko, the new the miniatures of their normal series, kind of. Except some of them are, you know, black with like the, only the main colored and whatnot. And it's awesome. This little box kind of shows you, like on the back here, it shows you the chart of like, you know, the rarity ratio and you know the Hot Topic exclusive line features let's see five of the actual you know characters of course background and otherwise with you know full coloring so like it says here you know the the Doctor Who's character there's like a little like there's a figurine somewhere that's colored and it's just it's cool it's really cute and I kind of wanted to get started in collecting them and my friend happened to buy me two of them so thank you very much I, I'm very happy to get these the two figurines that I got, I was happy and lucky enough to get one of the actual colored figurines. Of course it's Pinkie Pie, you know, who wouldn't have guessed that? <laughs> but she's cute, you know, I definitely, like, she's tiny. Like, to compare, here's her usual figurine size versus this. She's tiny. That's like baby Pinkie Pie. <laughs> but it's adorable. I love it. It's awesome. And who else did I get? Oh, which is hilarious. I also got Spitfire. And as you can see, this is the, you know, black bodied figurine kind of sort of... They, they just painted a few details and left the rest of it, you know, with no coloring. And it's it's really cool. It's It's a different take on it, especially compared to her usual figurine. Which I love that the two that I got, I already have in the larger forms. I think that's hilarious. But these are really nice, and I think I'd really like to continue collecting these. I was hoping I'd get Fluttershy on my first go, but hey, I'm not always that lucky. But yeah, but thank you for those. I also got a number of Enter Play goodies. <laughs> you know, I got one dog tag, one pack of booster cards for the CCG, and, you know, one pack of the normal Series 2 trading cards, and that was awesome. It was hilarious because I only got one pack of the trading cards, and I pulled a gold Luna from it. And, I mean, that's that's pretty awesome considering I haven't even opened a pack of Series 2 cards in a while. So, yeah, I'm definitely happy to have her. She may or may not be open for trade. I, I do already have one of her, but, you know, I'm open to offers. So if anyone's interested, there you go. But, uh... And that was awesome. And I got some pretty decent cards for the CCG. So I'm excited to add those to my deck. I'm still kind of working on building my own deck. But yeah, that was awesome. Thank you guys so much for the pony cards. I love the pony cards and the dog tag. I got a Rainbow Dash dog tag. So I'm pretty excited about that. And I also got this cool nifty little tin. And it was really interesting because I'm, I'm usually up to date on what merchandise is in stores currently. <laughs> And I hadn't realized that these had come out yet. And there's two different tins. There's this one, which is the derpy tin. And she's cute and adorable and whatnot. And there's also the rainbow dash tin. Which, you know, they both have the same stuff inside of them. But it's just two different tins. And it's cute. And on the inside, you know, she features two figure, like, um, figurine erasers. Which are cute. They're based off of kind of like the pop figurines. So here's rainbow dash, even though she really... I wish they had added more colors to her hair like she usually has, but, you know, they're they're cute. There's that. And, you know, here's the derpy one. It comes with two erasers, which are really cute. Although I will probably never use them for erasers. 
Uh, it came with two of these awesome pencils, and they're cute because they're so tiny. They really are. They're not big at all. And these awesome stickers. So I may or may not use these and stick them around places. So I, I don't know. The collector in me is like, just keep them together. I'm like, I might. We'll see. But they're awesome. So thank you very much for that. I, I love this stuff so much, guys. Seriously, this was awesome. And I had a great time at the party. And just, ah, it was so much fun. It was so much fun. But, uh... Let's see. Oh, a few other things I also managed to snag this past year, kind of, sort of, that I haven't gotten to show anyone yet. I managed to snag one of the display boxes from my local Walmart, thanks to a friend of mine. Thanks, Rin! And Michelle, and it was awesome. Like, I, I managed to snag this. So now I have a place to put all of my extras or whatever I decide to put in here. So I'm happy for that. This is, like, the dog tag display box. And I'm pretty happy to say that during the last Interplay flash sale, I managed to pick up, well, I only managed to pick up one item from that sale, but I am pretty proud to say that it was the Derpy Dog Tag, woo! The limited edition, you know, metallic silver, awesome, woo, dog tag. <laughs> so I'm really happy to have her, she's pretty cool. And just awesome stuff. Like, seriously, it's been a great year for ponies, and I can't wait to see what 2014 has in store for us. Like, seriously. Like, I love this so much. Um, what else? Oh, two more things before I let you go, because I know you're busy probably drinking, partying, whatever you may be doing, pony-wise. <laughs> and I also got a little something from a very special some pony of mine. I managed to get the, you know, 5-inch DJ Pwn 3 plushie that just came out. I also managed to get the, you know, new Applejack plush with her hat. She's also five inches. They're adorable. They're just awesome. I love these guys so much. They're so cute. Uh, two other plushies were also released in this line, but I have yet to collect them yet. These were the main two that I wanted. Uh, a Cheerilee plushie, which is adorable. She's awesome. Uh, and a Twilight with her wings plushie. Like, not the princess set, but, you know, just normal Twilight. Pretty much. Like, you know, picture this with wings and you got it. <laughs> but yeah, I love these. To compare, here's Applejack in her normal 5-inch size without the hat, and it's just, it's awesome. Like, I love that they added her hat finally. It's really cute. And another thing I love about this one is that she's got, she's got the chubbiest little cheeks on this plush. She's so cute. It's, it's really adorable. I, I don't know why I love it so much, but it's adorable. And here is her versus her 10-inch self. So yeah, it's a pretty big size difference and she's just so adorable. And of course, we wouldn't have the 5-inch set if we didn't have the 10-inch set as well. So there is a set of, you know, DJ Pond 3 and Cheerilee and all of them floating around. So there's, you know, there's the 10-inch set and there's a the 5-inch set. My special sum pony actually picked me up the two larger ponies as well. The two larger plushies, the 10 inch plushies. So I do have an Applejack plushie with her hat and I do have a DJ Pwn 3 plushie, you know, both 10 inch and 5 inch. So now I'm only missing four of the Funrise pony plushie collection. I'm only missing, you know, the, you know, miniature Cheerilee and the larger Cheerilee and the miniature, you know, Twilight with wings and of course, you know, the larger 10 inch Twilight alicorn. <laughs> Twilight with wings. I I want to call her an alicorn, but still. It's just, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm getting there. But yeah, this year has been awesome. Thank you all so much for watching, and I appreciate all, you know, my subscribers and viewers. It's been a lot of fun, and I hope you've enjoyed the ride along with me. We've seen a lot of pony action in 2013, and I cannot wait to find out what happens in 2014. Like, where is season four going to go? Are we going to find out what's inside that box? Or are they gonna, like, kick it to the next season? Hopefully not. They probably won't, but I still can't wait to see when they get that first key. It's gonna be so exciting. Like, I, I can just feel the excitement building up. I hope you can too. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, and be sure to stay tuned for the next video. Thanks, guys. Bye.